you've never experienced the power of mindset coaching, you don't understand how quickly your life can change. My life has transformed radically from mindset coaching. It's helped me produce more money and helped me on my path to financial freedom within my business too. My name is Joe Moffitt with Master Life by Design and today's video is how mindset coaching can make you more money and accelerate your path to financial freedom. So some of you are wondering, well, what is mindset coaching? What is peak performance coaching? And all it really is is helping someone go from point A to point B. Now, on our path, on our journey, and you know this throughout life, anything that you start, there's always challenges along the way. And coaching allows you to break through or break free from those challenges a lot faster, that, and they actually might even slow you down or if not stop you in your path. Right? I know fear is a big one that a lot of times I've worked with clients around that stops them from actually moving forward. For example, they may have a business idea, but they don't move forward, or they fear stops them, or they want to invest in a project or a, a real estate deal, but fear stops them. The fear of what could happen, what could they lose, and these are all things that stop us, but really it's our own psychology that's doing it, and it's not even true most of the time. And so mindset coaching allows someone with a 50,000 foot view to come in and see the entire landscape that you're experiencing and point out those blind spots. So I wanna share some things on what makes mindset coaching so powerful for people to create more money in their life and create financial freedom in their own life. All right, so the first one is limitations, AKA limiting beliefs. We all have them at, to some degree at some level and in different categories of our, our life, we may have more in that category than others. For example, I don't really believe I have too many limiting beliefs when it comes to the fitness area of my life, that category. I feel like I know what to do. I just need to execute on it. There's nothing that can stop me except for myself. There's no real limitations that I have. The only time I think it would really show up is during a workout when I'm really pushing and I'm like, okay, I think I'm done here. And it's like, no, 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 no. You're just experiencing a little bit of pain, a little bit of discomfort. You're not done. You're not done until you hit your number of reps that you decide. And so sometimes I have to break through that. Now, when it comes to business, a lot of times I find that clients have a lot of limited beliefs when it comes to business, when it comes to financial freedom, when it comes to investing. And so these are the areas that a coach can help work you through so you don't allow those limitations to stop you from going after what God's called you to go do. And so we call these limiting beliefs. Why? Because they're beliefs in our mind that limit us from actually moving forward. So coaching helps you break through that. And there's many different ways, there's many different different strategies to be able to do that. And so a coach can really help you do that. So for example, if you had a deal where if you put in $100,000, you could get $200,000 back within six months, would you do that? Now, some would be like, absolutely, no big deal. Others, they have the money, but they're like, well, what if I lose it? I don't know if I could get it back. I might need it. And right, all these scenarios come up and they're like, they come from a place of scarcity, so they don't do that and then they miss out on 100% return, which they're making $100,000. Now, are there opportunities out there? Yes, are there an abundance of them? Maybe not so much, but if you've ever come across one, let me know because I'd love to do that deal. Um, but in all seriousness, most people allow fear or scarcity to hold them back, these limiting beliefs that hold them back from actually, in this example, making $100,000 on top of their 100 grand. Don't allow that to be you. The next reason why mindset coaching is so powerful and create more income and more abundance on your path to financial freedom is because it teaches you how you are wired to tell you what your strengths are, where are the soft spots in your life, how to maximize your strengths, how to maximize those soft spots in your life. If you know how you're wired, you don't tend to beat yourself up because of how you're not wired and the things that you're not good at or how you're not acting, you actually take your gifts and you accelerate them. You actually utilize them to their full capability. So for example, in the DISC profile, I love going through the DISC assessment. I am what's called a high I. I have a 99 I and that is the influencer. And so what does the influencer love to do? They love to talk, they love to connect, they love building relationships, networking, they're very outgoing, very gargarious. They love to be the life of the party, right? And so knowing this, 
My whole life, I got in trouble in school for speaking and talking way too much. I even remember, I think it was in second or third grade, the teacher moved me away from every student and also taped my mouth. You know, so this was in the early 90s. Um, but she taped my mouth so I wouldn't talk anymore, right? Like, but I was getting punished for the God-given gift that I had. And if it wasn't for me understanding that, I would start to shut down. I would start to um, dim my light. I wouldn't be making these YouTube videos for you guys because I would be afraid to let my strength shine out there in the marketplace. And so if you understand how you're wired, you actually can use it as a competitive advantage. You also know where your skill sets are or where you would be great in a certain role within your business. So I just started a creative financing company and I know my strength is talking to sellers and negotiating and creating some awesome deals that would make it a win-win for all of us. I also have other people on my team they are really good at talking too, so they're the ones that are making the initial call and I get to come in and close the deal. So we're putting people in their strengths in the certain roles that they need to be in and I'm playing at my strength and we're all winning together. So it's important to understand how you're wired so you don't beat yourself up but you can maximize your strengths and where you're not as strong you can leverage those out to other people where it's their strengths you do this and you're gonna find that you're not gonna have the parking brake on but you're gonna have your foot on the gas and watch how fast you go in business next is blind spots we all have them I know that I have them you have them we all have them but a good coach is going to be able to point out the blind spots in your life that you may not see. See, when I start working with a client, which I have a very limited clients that I take on, but when I do, I tell them, hey, you're in this vehicle called coaching. You're in a driver's seat, you have your hands on the steering wheel, you decide what direction we're going and what our destination is. You also have your feet on the gas and brake, you decide how fast we go or how slow we go. That's entirely up to you. But where I show up, is your rear view side mirror is a rear view mirror i'm here to point out those blind spots that you might not see that may cause you to get into an accident or slow you down from your destination does that make sense and so i am here to help point out their blind spots where they don't see that they're holding back so let me give you a really good example i was on the phone with a gentleman the other day it was a couple days ago and he had this challenge with making phone calls and so we're going through some limited beliefs we're working through that working through some identity work but most importantly the biggest thing that i told him that stood out to him the most was he was playing defense when he actually needed to play offense and for him it was like a switch and so how many times has someone said something to you that you didn't even notice about yourself that when they pointed it out it made total sense and it turned the switch on for you I know that the power of coaching, it's done that many, many times in my life. And I'll even give you a really good example with my wife. There was a moment where before we started hanging out and dating, we were just talking. I was getting all up in my head on why it wouldn't work. She lived in the Bay Area and I lived in San Diego and I was just all in my head. And I almost kind of like was discarding her. I was, I was gonna be like, you know what, forget it. Forget her, I'm done. You know, and then we didn't even get started. <clears throat> so I reached out to my coach and we jumped on a coaching call and we were talking through it all and she said one question because there was a blind spot for me she said joe what do you want and i said i want her and she's like well, then go get her and for me that switch went off again and literally it's the reason one of the biggest reasons why i'm married today and not still single and dating because i had a blind spot pointed out and that blind spot was I was being silly and not going after what I wanted. I was focusing on the circumstances versus what I wanted. And when I flipped that switch, when I changed that dial, I would did everything I could to win my wife's heart. And here we are. So, ooh la la. All right. Okay, so I already talked about offense versus defense, but that's my next point. When we're talking on a macro level, sometimes I see people, they're living in defense. They're playing prevent defense when they really need to be playing offense. So for example, if you're doing sales or you're doing sales calls or you're a real estate agent or a real estate investor where you gotta make calls and you're playing defensive, like you don't want to screw it up, you don't wanna lose the deal, you don't wanna you know, piss the person off, and you're playing conservatively, I'm gonna tell you, you're most likely never going to win. 
okay? It's the ones that play offense that are actually the ones who win. I love the Wolf of Wall Street movie. Now I get things were done illegally, but his attitude was offense, not defense. And so when I work with these people, helping them go from defense to offense is one of the biggest game changers that you can make as a coach for a client. And so coaching really helps you make that shift. Now, are there times where you may need to be on defense? Yeah, sure. However, when I'm working with high performers who are looking to create financial freedom, increase their income, you gotta most likely play on offense when you're taking new ground, new territory in the marketplace. You can't do that on defense. You're never going to score. And yeah, you might not lose anything, but you're certainly not gonna win anything. Coaching allows you to go from defense to offense when you're playing small. Which brings up the next point, which is your coach doesn't allow you to play small. A coach allows you to play at your maximum capability. That's why they call out your blind spots, but they hold you to a higher standard. See, my coaches always called me out when I wasn't playing at my best. And I appreciated that because it caused me to step up. And every time I stepped up, I, I had great results from you know my body. I did a fitness photo shoot when I got a coach that challenged me to go from a level 7 to a level 10 in my body. There's pictures on Instagram if you scroll way back. Maybe we'll put a picture up on here of that. But it helped me in my body. It helped me start my business when I was afraid to. It helped me start coaching private clients instead of when I was working at Tony Robbins. I actually started doing both. There are so many areas where I was stretched because my coach did not, I repeat, did not allow me to play small. Some of us you're watching this video and you know right now you're playing small. You know you can play at a higher level. You know you can raise the standard in your life, but no one's holding you accountable. And that's what a coach does, which leads me to the next point is accountability. See, a lot of people, they don't have that accountability so that they can play small for an extended period of time. And then the next thing they know, they look back and they're like, how did the last three years or five years get away from me? Why am I not anywhere near ahead of where I wanted to be, where I set my goals to be? And that's because you don't have accountability. If you want to excel, you can do a lot of these great things in your life, in your business, but if you don't have accountability from someone that you're meeting with on a weekly or bi-weekly basis, you're actually cutting yourself short. You could be playing life at a bigger level and you don't even know it. Maybe you do know it. And maybe it's time for you to step up. And so I'm calling you out right now. If you know that you're playing small, you know you can play bigger, your life was meant for bigger things, greater things, more abundance in your life so that you could be a blessing to others, then I'm challenging you now to reach out so that we can get you a coach so that you can stop playing small, so you can stop living in scarcity, you can step into your greatness, step into abundance, and start making more money and having more financial freedom in your life so you can go be a blessing to others. We talk about financial freedom a lot here because it's a starting point, but you also want to make sure you're going out and giving back and making an impact to others out there, especially in a marketplace if that's where you're winning. So I challenge you to reach out and make sure that you email us at support at masterlifebydesign.com uh, or you can go to masterlifebydesign.com backslash coaching and you can go ahead and fill out the application so that we can reach out to you and get you in with a coach because I promise you, Money comes and goes, but the breakthroughs that you have, when you break the limitations, when you have the accountability, when you're playing offense, you're raising your standard, I'm telling you, you'll play life at a much greater level and you will succeed. It's happened in my life. It's happened thousands of clients that I've worked with over this last decade. I'm telling you, your life can transform and you're worth it. It's worth it. All right, so let me give you one last success story from one of my clients that I've been working with for years and years and years that I absolutely love. And he attributes our coaching to his success where we've broken through limiting beliefs, his identities, we called him on his blind spots. I've helped him transform um, from playing defense to offense, which was a huge shift for him, helping him really um, go out and set the standard in which the way he wanted to live his life and really break through those limitations and I held him accountable for a while and so here was this young kid he came to me when he was 18 and we worked on his business that he was in he was doing great we doubled his income and then all of a sudden he wanted to play life at a bigger level there was people in his life that he knew from masterminds and mentorship that would allow him to play at a higher level. He thought that he could bring value to them. 
And so we worked through a lot of limiting beliefs in order for him to reach out and create a partnership. Well, as a result of that partnership, as a result of him having the courage and playing offense versus defense, fast forward, they created a partnership. They started investing a lot of money into their product that they marketed. And as a result, by age 21, he was making $300,000 a month. Not a year, I'm not talking a year, a month. And he actually flew me and my wife down to Miami to, around Christmas time many years ago to be able to speak to his team. We went out to dinner, he bought us, I've never had Wagyu beef so good as I did in Miami. And it was unbelievable. He was picking up checks, or you know, our checks for dinner over a few nights of $3,500, five grand, seven grand, and why? Because he could afford to do it first class. And he, that was one way that he was able to say thank you to me for helping him break through. Now, is that gonna happen to everyone? Probably not. However, there's a dream in your heart, there's a business that you wanna start, or there's something that in, within your business you know you need to do, you need to step up on offense and not play defense, and that you can go to that next level. You just need some accountability. You just need some tough love or a loving hand that says, hey, I know you can do more. What's going on? Because coaches do great at asking brilliant questions that help you see a different perspective so that you can take action and increase your performance will help make more money and ultimately help you on your path to financial freedom. So if that's you, I'm gonna encourage you again to reach out because I know what coaching has done to my life. I wouldn't be married, I wouldn't have a business, and I would not be talking to you on this video right now if it wasn't for the power of coaching to transform my life and for me to step up, stop playing small, and play at a higher level. All right, so with that, I hope you found value in this. Again, if you're looking for a coach, reach out. I have an incredible team that is really excellent at what they do in the coaching world. I can also work with another three clients maximum right now. So if that's you, just know it's going to be a higher price point to working with my clients or my coaches, excuse me. But just know that you're worth it. Money comes and goes, but the transformation and the compound effect over months and years far outweighs the money that you spend on coaching. I always tell people this, successful people make decisions based on where they're going, not where they currently are. And I can't tell you how many times people have sold stock to work with me. They've, they've sold their car even. It was pretty crazy to hear that one. They took out loans. They worked a second job. They drove Uber just to, for coaching. And they got more of an ROI on their investment. I'm not saying this because I'm so great. I'm saying this because the power of coaching is so powerful. And if you don't wanna work with me or anyone on my team, go find a coach. I'm telling you, you won't regret it. I promise you. Okay, so with that, I hope you found value. Make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you like this and comment below, but most importantly, subscribe and turn that notification bell on so that we know when you actually, or so you know, excuse me, when you actually have a new video coming out here at Master Life by Design. So with that, my name's Joe Moffitt with Master Life by Design. Have a great one. See you guys.